Hey everybody, Kathy here with Paint Pouring by Kathleen Miller. How is everyone doing today? I have a 10 by 20 canvas. I already have my base coat down, which is color uh, to go by Sherwin Williams. Uh, no silicone, no water, no glue. And um, I'm all full of paint, so I know I'm gonna be all full of paint. Today I'm doing a primary secondary swipe. My colors are going to be African Jade and Stargazer by Primary Elements. Josanja Burgundy and Dioxazine Purple by Liquitex. This is uh, Palazzo by Primary Elements, and this is Cranberry by Primary Elements. Now that's your f first primary. That's my primary. Swiping colors. My secondary is Apple Rose by Primary Elements, Jasmine Primary Elements, Quinacridone Violet by Golden. And then I'm gonna throw in a little bit of Egyptian coin in there. Walk like an Egyptian. <laughs> No, However, okay, go, go ahead. I'm going to have my black cell activator swiping first, and over the pinks and the violets, it's going to be a permanent violet by Amsterdam so. um, cell activator, which is permanent violet, blue violet by Amsterdam, and oxide black by Amsterdam, and it has Australian Floetrol. Okay, so. so that's kind of a new twist using two different cell activators for each swipe. Well, we're just gonna see how that helps, Phil, or works. Helps. Heaven help us. Oh, <laughs> shoot, I just got that out there already. Did not want to do that. Well, I can get that off. Phil will have all these colors in the description box. Head on over to Color Art Primary Elements. Pick yourselves up some of these colors. They are absolutely beautiful. Okay, so you've put the primary swipe colors down. Right. And now you're going to put use a black cell activator to swipe with. Correct. All right, well, I'm just trying to get into my head what you're I'm doing to here. Get in my head <laughs> what I'm doing. So Kathy's black cell activator, as she mentioned, is oxide black from Amsterdam, which is a paint, and Australian Floetrol. It's a pretty long swipe. Got to be really careful with this, Phil. Long swipe. Well, I wonder if you can start in the middle and go halfway and then go the other way halfway. I was going, oh, I was going to oh, go whatever and you bring do. it down. Okay. And then I was going to go down. I got you. All right. Ah, oh, you're going to be fine. You're going to be fine there, I can tell. Look at that. Okay. Pretty so okay. far. Those were the four colors that Kathy laid down on that primary swipe. And then... Of course, those are the colors that are showing, the cells. Now we're going for the other side. Okay. There we go. Very good. Well, you got some nice cells instantaneously picking up the swipe colors. So the first swipe is a success so far. <laughs> <laughs> so far, so good, everybody. Oh, all these pigments and paint colors that Kathy's using do have the same recipe, and that's in video 478. Okay. <laughs> There's a direct link to that recipe video in the description box. Okay, now here's the secondary swipe colors. Which one is that? This is Apple Rose. Apple Rose. Good old Jasmine by Primary Elements. And Quinacridone Violet by Golden. You know, the object of the primary and secondary swipe technique is to try to get swipes of contrasting or complementary colors 
on other areas of the canvas. At least that's, that's the intent anyways. So now you're going to use that other cell activator, correct? Mm -hmm. I'm a little hesitant, but I'm going to do it. All right. Because I'm thinking it might be. Let's open. see what that looks like. Okay. It's pretty. Very pretty. But I'm going to. Uh... Okay. Might be a little dark here, but we're going to see. Doing that one a little bit different. That's fine. I'm gonna get some super cells there, which is nice. I don't think I'm gonna use this now. Now I'm gonna use my cards. Okay. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use some of my cards, people. Okay, where am I? So going? Kathy also uses Plain old playing cards sometimes to do her swipes when she wants to do swipes that are perhaps uh, in smaller areas or shorter swipes. Oh, wow. Beautiful. Kathy does have four shops for you to peruse. She has her Amazon shop, which has all the supplies you may need for paint pouring. She has her Etsy shop, which has all her original art for sale. She has a Redbubble shop, which has her images imprinted on a wide variety of merchandise. And she has her Le Gallerist fine clothing shop, which of course has her images imprinted on Really cool tops and dresses and so forth. Very nice, high quality clothing. It's just fun to go in, peruse around, click on one of the images and see what it looks like on a wide variety of merchandise. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Why are you saying that, oh no, Phil? <laughs> the smile has already started. and Well, you know what that means. It means it's marble time. Simply marvelous. I think you want to do it this way because you want to leave a lot of negative space on this one. Is that correct? I do. Okay. Simply marvelous. It's wonderful that you should care for me. <laughs> okay. We have a bunch of marbles today, Phil. Well, you wanted to put a clean marble on there? Is that why yeah. did you have? Okay. Usually you don't uh, have the marble go off right away. Yeah. I didn't like what it was doing. Okay. It was disobeying Mama. So it goes into the gutter. This is so cool. <laughs> this is so cool. See, this one's listening to me. He knows where he's going if he doesn't. <laughs> he's going into the gutter. like this marble colored oh this better than the way it is in brown 
Now, I don't think I have to do it anywhere else. No, I think you've got a good, it's kind of evenly distributed the, uh, where the marble rolled. Yeah, I was just thinking I should maybe have it here and go down. But I don't want to overdo it. No, I agree because it's. I'm just going to leave it. I think it's going to be fine. Well, you've got some wonderful colors. Okay, where are my marbles? I got to get my marbles out of here. One. I lost one of my feet already. Or maybe that was stuck in there. Where's my other marble? You lost your marbles, huh? I did. <laughs> I don't well, know where it is. You can get it. I'll get it later. Okay. Was this going to be pretty, Phil? Yeah, those colors that you picked out for the primary and secondary swipes are really looking nice together. Oh, wow. Oh, I love this. There we go. Have a This bow. is so, so pretty, people. Super. <gasps> and it's gorgeous. What, what was the color of the cell activator you used the second it's time? It's the uh, permanent. Violet, was it? It's the permanent blue violet by Amsterdam. Oh, I mean, it's just, it's just beautiful. I oh, thought it was going to be a little dark, but it isn't at no, all. It it's, isn't. it's stunning. Now, the black cell activator went on, uh, around... Very nicely. You know what's kind of cool about the black cell activator? What? Um, it made the white. It went around the white, if you look. Made white cells. Oh, yeah. Which is so cool. You got so cool. nice white cells. You got these beautiful uh, Egyptian coin cells and uh, the purples that you put down. This is and, really stunning. This is really stunning. Here are the Egyptian coin and the reds you put down. I call them reds. They were different colors but actually um well we have the apple rose yes okay the quinacridone violet and jasmine right they all they went out together very really nicely really there. pretty and then i like how the josanja Ooh. burgundy and the dioxine purple and the cranberry mingled together right i think that might be more in this area here too and then you just have a tad of these blues just a tad of the blue coming through it it's really really pretty it, it is the uh it's soft and pretty i love the design because it's not overdone mm -mm. with the wrecking lines from rolling the marble not at all you've got all the beautiful colors of the primary and secondary swipes coming through there i am so excited with this i could just scream <laughs> and it's all set off by that uh, by the negative space it is it really is it's really beautiful people so if you like this Give me a thumbs up because I love it. So I'm giving myself a double thumbs up because, I mean, I am really excited. And please subscribe to our channel. We would love to have you join our family. That's where you can get all the benefits from my teaching, um, what I'm going to do, how I mix my, my pigments, how I mix different colors together. That's where you can get all this information from joining our Facebook page, Paint Pouring by Kathleen Miller, you can get tons of information from people on there. They will help you. If you have a question, they will help you. Someone in that group will help you, including Phil and I. So I have had a blast doing this today. After I'm done with this, I gotta go watch my two little baby birds. They're just about flapping, flapping, flapping. And I said to Phil, if I make that video and I miss them taking off out of that tree, I'm gonna be so upset. Well, yeah, they take a few steps. Uh, uh, at the edge. At the flap, edge of flap, their flap, nest. Flap, and and then they, all of a sudden they look at each other like, are you gonna go? I'm not going, you go first. It's so darn cute. So hopefully I didn't miss them. But until the next time, everybody stay healthy, stay well, stay safe. It's only paint. We love all of you, and until then, we will say goodbye until tomorrow. Bye-bye. I love this. Yes. I love this. Everything, everything worked together. The colors, and you got a real nice design from the rolling marble, and everything just coordinated into a very nice painting. I'm going to come down and take a look at this.